Hey there, I'm back and it's finally time for the Halloween reactions. I think I'm going to take them sort of in publishing order of the original songs. I don't know the publishing order of these videos, but I, that means I'm gonna start with Pirate King. And then I'm gonna do Wonderland and then Deja Vu. So, yeah. Let's do it. Jumping straight into Pirate King. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. So they're doing this on the street. This must be doing that early, like, baby wear. I couldn't imagine they would be able to... Not, ba maybe not debut era, but at least still early, I guess. Because I can't imagine them being able to pull off this sort of thing on the street, like, today. Without getting over here. Oh, looks like they actually used SFX makeup because those look like scratches are actually in his cheek as well as down here it looks like an open wound that's cool that it's not just makeup but they actually use some special effects makeup as well that's all awesome. Uh, know how sticky that fake blood is though. So oh, Jesus, those, those contacts. Oh. I love how all out they've gone. Oh, cool detail with the hand. Is he wearing UV contacts? Dude! Oh my god! Oh my god. Okay, I don't think they're UV because they did the same effect for Jung Ho's here, so I think that's uh, edited in post, which is too bad. But to be honest, couldn't really be UV contacts either because there's no UV light here. Still looks cool though. Love that one though. It looks so insane, I love this.
Like, I know it's post-production, those contacts, but he should really use contacts in that color at some point. Because that suits him so well. I love, love how they go all out for this shit. Oh, the only thing... I wouldn't even say negative, but not positive, I have to say, is... This makes me wish that they had a Halloween performance version of every one of their singles, at least. Like, oh my god. I love how dedicated they are to it. Okay, here we go with Wonderland. Just realized the whole video has been flipped. Well, then I don't need to change anything because this is MNET. So we know how it goes. I'll probably have to block out a good amount of the screen. But flipping it sometimes helps. And this is Wonderland. It looked like it was some sort of a like, clown jester uh, sort of concept. I've seen some still images of uh, a few of them from this performance. So I'm really looking forward to it, especially because I love Wonderland. So this is going to be great. And let's go. Ooh. Okay, I don't think it's from this performance. I've seen pictures. Now that I see the styling. <laughs> oh, yes, it is. So, so well. Ooh, love Yun Ho's makeup. Don't know about the styling of Sun's hair, though. Uh, was Jung Ho inju injured here? Oh, oh, that's interesting. Ooh. Wish the camera shake wasn't there though. <laughs> He's doing pretty great with Mengi's part, to be honest. Oh my god! <laughs> Son, he, I love how he's just letting himself dangle there. That looks so creepy, and I love it. Ooh. I really want a still close up of Sun's makeup because that looks so interesting. Ooh, Jung Ho! <laughs> Ooh, a little change up. Oh, 
boom. Did you see how Hung Jung, instead of going for Sun's chest like he usually does there, he went for his face? Such a little change, but made it much creepier. Ooh, love that. Love that ending though. Oh, that's so cool. We are that's so cool. I really love the energy Yunho put in this. Like, he seemed like a completely different person in this performance. I love that. Love the styling. I need to see if I can pi find pictures of their individual um, makeup because. They were all different, but every single one of them seemed interesting to me. I really loved the um, like um, bloodshot eyes on Jung Ho. Speaking of Jung Ho, he put all his energy into that performance, even though he couldn't get off the stool, and he did so well, like. Every time the camera camera focused in on him, you could still feel the same energy from him that you felt from the rest, even though he couldn't join them, which is awesome. It's not easy to give that amount of energy while sitting. So, yeah. Let's go to the next one, and it is also the last one. It is Deja Vu, and it seemed to be a vampire concept. Two seconds. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I I love Hung Jung's hair a little too much here. Already love the vampire style in here. He still gets stuck in those caves. Is it bad that I have a harness that looks very much like the one Hong Kong is wearing in this? Oh, dude! I really love that belt corset thing on Songwa that looks amazing on it. I 
haben wir schon die Gewalt in den Kopf gehabt. Okay. Wow. That shirt showed a lot more than the one he wore in the performance I just reacted to. Jesus Christ. And he's wearing a body harness underneath it. Who allowed these gloves? They look amazing. These guys, <clears throat> amazing choice from their side to pick vampires for Deja Vu, which is one of their more sensual songs that definitely fits. I, I don't see what else they, if they had already chosen that Deja Vu was the one they were going to do a Halloween performance of, I don't see what else they could have chosen to be dressed as that would have fit the theme of the song. They probably could come up with something, but vampires fit it very well. I am definitely not disappointed in checking out the Halloween performances and I'm looking forward to any of those kind of performances they put forward in the future. Because clearly Halloween, they got it down. So, wow. It's no surprise really because from what I've seen they just take a concept and run with it. They know how to do that so well. So, yeah. It's no surprise that they they would do well in this, but <sighs> this was amazing. This was amazing. I loved this. I loved everything about it. Of course, this most replayed part is your song <coughs> lifting his shirt. <sighs> of course, um, it is Eternal Sunshine. That's going to be the next uh, video reaction from me when it comes to 80s. So yeah. I'm looking forward to it and I'm actually almost through all the music videos and I'm looking forward to getting to the album listens and I know that I believe it was in the end of this month they had a Japanese uh, mini album drop so I'm looking forward to that as well so yeah Thank you guys for watching and I hope it's okay that this comes in November even though we passed Halloween I just didn't want to wait any longer uh, and yeah so it was more fitting to do it now rather uh, than at some random time after I finished all the music videos so yeah as always thanks for watching and I'm looking forward to see you guys comments on these videos I love to see your opinions and uh, pointing out stuff to me that I might have missed and yeah in general I just I just love interacting with you guys you guys are very active in my comments and I love it so yeah 
I will see you on the next video, which will be Eternal Sunshine. Bye!